Howdy there gamers, welcome back. I love a good internet troll, alright? But sometimes they do get a little bit out of hand. Just like this one that we're taking a look at today, alright? Because I think the entire LGBTQ community has been fucking debated by one child here, alright? Now, you don't know, this guy went onto TikTok. He uh, made a new sexuality called Super Straight. Super Straight are attracted to only cis women, alright? You're not attracted to transgender women. You're only attracted to women who were born as women. This is basically taking the mick out of the people saying, that you're transphobic if you don't want to date a trans woman, which is just a retarded claim in general. But this has kind of gotten out of hand, and now there are three sides on this, all right? The people who are just laughing at everything, the people who are super phobic, and the people who now identify as super straight. Now, to the people who identify as super straight, and the people who are now super phobic, who are dumbasses, all right? This is all a joke. You have been fucking debated. That's all I'm gonna say. The joke does expose the fucking hypocrisy. I've never understood the claim for a transphobe if you don't want to date a trans woman woman. It just doesn't make any sense to me. People are allowed to have preferences, all right? Literally what these people have been fighting for for years. What's the problem now? Oh, you don't like it? Makes sense. See, my sonic screwdriver here is also a clown detector. And at the moment, well, it's just fucking off the charts. Jesus Christ, clowns are everywhere. I think the most clowns are on Twitter. There's a lot of people trolling on Twitter. When the news broke, super straight being a fucking thing, a lot of people jumped on it, you know, started to meme on the whole situation. So I've got a fucking trilogy, just an amazing Twitter trilogy here of a guy who just fucking trolled the shit out of this person on Twitter. So they said, imagine you're straight, but you're also super saiyan. Then somebody's like, how is not the time to meme about it, all right? The type of people who when they don't like something can't joke about it all right somebody is offended or doesn't like a situation no jokes allowed all right he then goes on to continue the trolling quite fucking funny you're right i need to go a level beyond this is it Super Straight 2. I haven't actually watched Dragon Ball. I've seen like one movie, but I do have like a Super God Funko Pop or whatever. This is the Funko Pop. It says SSG Goku. This is obviously Super Straight God Goku. So he's so fucking straight. He's just not even attracted to women anymore. Only the vagina. And obviously the guy, he's getting even more triggered. He's like, seriously, Super Straight isn't something to meme about. Read the room. That's right, the room is a fucking book. How do you fucking read a room? Like, I understand people saying that it's not something to joke about. Like, literally the whole thing was started as a joke. He continues the fucking trolling. I mean, he's a legend, an internet god. Of course, how could I be so foolish? I need to go even further beyond. I've gone beyond my limits. Super straight three. That's right, he's gone to the fucking triple, baby. He can just think about nothing but women. If he thinks about a man, he just fucking dies. This, this is how it works now. It seems like Super Straight 3 was too much for him. And he got blocked. Obviously, this man fucking won. But then, the saga continues on Twitter. He, he goes, I've done it. I've reached drip straight. He fucking did it. Now, I don't even know how to fucking explain drip straight. So powerful, it's unexplainable. Nobody, nobody knows what the fuck is going on anymore. These are confusing times. Anyway, now we've looked at uh, the people memeing on the whole situation. Let's look at the people who are actually serious about this whole thing, all right? This thing that was started as a joke has now just turned into like a full-fledged war. Are you excited, Obama? We're back at war, all right? Obviously, there are some disgusting pricks who are using this situation to generate actually be transphobic is obviously just fucking disgusting whole thing was just meant to be a joke don't ruin it look clown detectors off the chart there are also people on the other side ending death threats to people literally joking about it all right the guy who started it all right i don't even you know this he started it as a fucking joke there were people sending him and his fucking family death threats so he had to remove his video you can't have fun on the internet anymore i do just think it's fucking hypocritical when there's people in the lgbt community sorry if i don't say all the letters all Right. Just too many of them. Right? It's like longer than the fucking alphabet at this point. So there's people in that community who say shit like you should be able to love whoever you want. All right? so I agree with you should be able to love whoever you want. So why is it different now that there's people coming out and saying, yes, I'm only attracted to these types of people. They're going like. No, you can't fucking do that. You can't fucking do that. You can't fucking do that. Fucking... Jesus Christ. The clown detector broke. Shit. Gotta make sure that doesn't happen again. Yeah, like, what's the difference? Are you accepting of everybody or not? I thought it would be a pretty logical thing for people to realize that some people don't want to date trans women, even if they're straight. Like, maybe some people do, and that's fine. But if you don't, that's also fine. You shouldn't be shamed for, like, not wanting to date somebody just because they have an aspect that you don't like, all right? A penis, all right? If you're straight, you might not like penis, all right? And if somebody who wants to date you has a penis, chances are they're not gonna like them back. Just 
how the cookie crumbles. That's not transphobic, that's just their personal preference. You should be accepting of me. I'm so straight, I don't even like women. I only like the vagina. That's all I'm attracted to, okay? I'm gonna make a new sexuality, all right? It's called the epic sexuality, where you're only attracted to basically pocket pussies. You disagree with me? If you say that's wrong, fucking epic phobic. So get the fuck out. So yeah, that's the internet's newest meme. Super straight movement, all right? You better get ready for like the fucking hentai weeps to rise up next, all right? That's what we should all be scared about, all right? Those grown men crying that a fucking cartoon bunny no longer has thick thighs. Damn it. Can you believe that, Obama? Anyway, thanks for coming along today, gamers. I hope you enjoy. So I'll see you in the next video. But yeah, uh, I'll see you later. Farewell. Oh my, oh my. Thank you.